Hey up photo clips, have I been waiting for this package to arrive? Yes I have. It's at eight, four times eight gigabytes of RAM for my iMac. The iMac, I feel like it's getting a little bit old. It's three years old, it's starting to struggle a little bit. And I was talking to a friend and he says, well, up your RAM. Uh, the onboard RAM is two, four sticks of gigabytes. So it's eight, it's got eight in it at the minute. I'm gonna take them out and I'm gonna put eight, eight, eight and eight. Let me show you on the map. It's crucial memory. I've got no clue what memory to buy, so I got in touch with my friend Jazz, who put me right. He says it's a well-known company. They're really good. You get a good guarantee, lifetime guarantee. The way you chose your memory was absolutely fantastic. There were two ways. You could either download an app, click it, open it, and it will scan your computer. You can find your Mac on the their site and it just tells you exactly which one you want. I've never ever done anything like this. I'm not really computer minded. You know, when it comes to building them and making them, I mean, I'm not daft, I know sort of what to do. And I thank YouTube for a lot of help and I also thank my bud Jazz. And um, I'm just gonna give it a go. So if I can do it, seriously, if I can do it, anybody can do it. And you can see that it's got four gig, four gig, and then two empty slots. So by the end of it, that should say eight, 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 and eight. Let's see how it goes. Ooh, I'm excited. I hope it works. Keep fingers crossed. Okay, guys, first things first. We've turned the power off. There's no power going to it. And... Uh, unplug the mains cable so there's nothing in there now but I'm also going to unplug all the USB ports as well just to be safe so once you've unplugged and you've made a cup of tea The next stage is just to pop open this little door. So this door's now just popped open and fell out. Then inside you can see these clips. Push them towards you. Like so. So I'm just going to go in here lightly. Pull out this ram. One, two. So now we're going to plug it back in and then it will be the moment of truth. Oh, 32 gig installed. 8, 8, 8 and 8. So it looks like I've done it right. Now, if I'm not happy with the performance, it's gonna to have to be a clean installation of the software, get rid of the crap that's on there, and just start again. Cheers, guys. Give it a go. Honestly, I mean, I feel loads better now it's fired up. But uh, yeah, okay, thank you. Take care, see you soon. So that was a few days ago that video and since I recorded that uh, the map is uh, 
she's running like a dream back to where she was, back to how I need her to perform. Um, yeah, I've got iMovie open, iTunes open, Adobe Photoshop open. I've got my files with all my raw images in open. You just press the button and it's, it's there within seconds, just how it should be. So if your Mac's running a little bit sluggish, invest in some RAM. Just up the RAM. I mean, I maxed it out. I can't do any more. So when it starts to go again, it will be time for a new one. And I'm hoping to get a couple more years out of it. So we'll see how it goes. So in my opinion, if you're sluggish, up the RAM. Okay, guys, that's it. Um, take care. I hope I've helped you out. And don't forget, get out and shoot. You know you want to. Cheers, guys.